It's time to meet our pet of the week. Here to introduce us is Lee Turbert from the Montgomery Humane Society. Who have you brought today? This is little Soka. He's three months old, the little terrier mix. There's a litter of six, and he doesn't act this way when he's with his brothers and sisters. They're very noisy puppies, as usual, but very, very sweet. He hasn't had a surgery yet, so he's in with our Foster with Intent program, but he makes somebody a wonderful pet. Yes, he is such a handsome little guy. He's just a little shy on TV right now. Yes. The camera's making him a little nervous. Doesn't even want his little treat. No, there. I think he's going to wait until afterwards. You've had a lot of dogs come in <sighs> yeah. recently. Yeah, a lot. Um, since Wednesday, we got 73 more. And that's 73. just 73. And that's six months or older. Yeah, it's. Why do you think so many are being surrendered right now? A lot of them are, um, you know, strays. And, you know, we know that things happen. They get away from the family. So we hold them for five days. We hope that they, people come and claim them. If not, we, you know, we process them, put them up for adoption. But, you know, our, our cages are full, very, very full. 73 in less than a week. What does that do to you there at the shelter? And how does that compare to a normal week? Um, we don't get that many in a week. I mean, we're getting prepared now for puppy and kitten season, so we're slammed. We're just going to be slammed. So people, I mean, we just can't emphasize enough to get your pets spay or neutered. You know, and if you can't afford them, bring them to the shelter fi or find them another good home, but make sure that they're spay or neutered so, you know, the overpopulation will stop. Yeah, that we don't keep adding more and more pets that won't yes. have a home to the yes. population. Mm -hmm. How can we help you right now? And are you offering any specials? Because we of are. Um, any dog that is 25 pounds or over, over, um, we're running. You know, um, luck for the homeless until St. Patty's Day Sunday. The adoption fee is only 25 dollars. So great time. I mean, adult dogs. Are, you know, the majority of them are already house trained. They have manners. Um, all they need is just a forever home. A lot of them are moving ready. They just need some love. That's it. Just, Don't you know, they? a home that's going to love them forever. You all have a lot going on this weekend, including a baby shower. We have a baby shower at our shelter from one to four, and it's to prepare for our puppy and kitten season that's coming in. So we're asking for donations. Just go to our um, website or to our Facebook page. It'll tell you the items that we need. Also, monetary donations will help. But it's just getting all those supplies in. Hopefully, we'll have more foster families that we can give those supplies to while they're taking care of the pets. What are some of the big items? Items that you need right now? Um, you know, litter, um, litter trays, um, cat litter, um, kitten food, um, puppy food, treats, um, collars, blankets, anything that, you know, a new little baby of kitten or a puppy would need, that's what we would gladly accept. And folks can also come see some of the animals out at the rodeo. We are going to be at the rodeo also Sunday, so stop by with our great volunteers. will be there bringing some adult dogs. Hopefully they'll find homes. Lee, thank you so much for joining us. You're welcome. You'll find a new home very soon.